Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Ravella Design. Today I'm going to show you how we are going to make this beautiful crochet cardigan. It is very nice to wear in summertime at beaches. It is also wearable at uh, springtime, fall time. Now we are in the first part of uh, this video. In the first part, I am going to explain you how we are going to make this back side, also the front side. And in the second video, uh, I'm going to teach you how we are going to make the sleeves like this and how we are going to make the uh, skirt split like this and uh, how we are going to give the final uh, look, how we are going to finish this cardigan. Okay, dear friends, let's go on how to make this. Meanwhile, please remember to subscribe my YouTube channel, activate the info bell. Please leave like remarks and make comments and share my videos for my future video tutorials. Thank you so much. Let's go on how to make this. We need this kind of uh, cotton yarn, dear friends. We need three and a half millimeters hook. First of all, we are going to crochet this kind of part. This part is uh, for the back side of the cardigan, dear friends, from one shoulder to another we are making chains and we are crocheting till the armpit. I try to draw it for you. This is our back side. We are taking a tape measure in our hand and we are uh, measuring from one shoulder to another from here. According to my size it is 48 centimeters dear friends from here to here according to my size it is 48 for this reason I made chain uh, 48 centimeters okay firstly let's make 48 centimeters I am taking my yarn in my hand and making chains till we reach 48 centimeters of course you are going to make it according to your own size maybe uh, between your uh, shoulders uh, is narrow maybe wide uh, that depends on you make chains uh, according to the size of between your arms as i showed you uh, in the picture dear friends I made my chains, dear friends. I measured it. It is 48 centimeters according to my shoulder size. And now I am making five chains. One, two, three, four, and five. After making five chains, I am making yarn over, inserting my hook in the 48th chain and making a double crochet. I am considering this five chains as the first double crochet and now I made the second double crochet. In this uh, first row I have now two double crochet. I am making one chain and I am inserting my hook in the same place. I mean in the same stitch. I made one double crochet and I am making one more double crochet. like this now i'm going to make five chains one two three four and five yarn over i am counting seven chains here one two three four five six seven and in the eighth chain i am inserting my hook and making a double crochet yarn over i am inserting my hook in the same stitch and making the second double crochet in this stitch i am making one chain yarn over inserting my hook in the same stitch and making two more double crochet same stitch inserting my hook making the second double crochet 
like this. We are going to make this pattern, dear friends. Two double crochet firstly in one stitch and then one chain and then two double crochet more. It's been like this. And between these uh, two pattern, we are making five chains. Now I am going to make five chains. One, two, three, four and five. Yarn over. Now I am counting seven chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. In the eighth chain, I am inserting my hook. Making a double crochet. Yarn over, inserting my hook in the same stitch here and making the second double crochet. Making one chain, yarn over, inserting my hook in the same stitch, making one double crochet first and then the second double crochet. Making one, two, three, four, five chains and counting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven chains. In the eighth chain, I am inserting my hook, making a double crochet. Another double crochet. One chain, inserting my hook in the same stitch making two more double crochet and then I am going to make five chains I'm going to count seven chain here in the eighth chain I am going to insert my hook and I'm going to make this pattern this row is going on like this dear friends we are making this till the end of the chain I came to the end of the row let me show you 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 pattern I made from this dear friends. Of course, yours can be uh, in different amount according to the size of your uh, shoulder size, uh, the size between uh, your two shoulders. Uh, for the second row, I am turning back and Till the center, I will make slip stitches one by one. Here, I'm making one slip stitch. I came to the center, making another slip stitch. Now I am in the center. I am making one, two, three chains, yarn over. I am making a double crochet, making one chain, and in the same uh, center I am making two more double crochet this is one and this is two now making five chains the pattern is so so easy dear friends we will repeat always the same thing one two three four five yarn over coming uh, to the center of this pattern inserting my hook making two double crochet firstly this is one this is two after two double crochet I am making one chain and in the same uh, space I am making two more double crochet one and two it's been like this making five chain one two three four five yarn over going to the center of the other pattern making a double crochet making second double crochet making one chain and in the same space making two more double crochet this is a one and this is two and then making five chains going to the center of this following pattern and like this 
we are coming to the end of this uh, row dear friends I came to the end of the second row as well dear friends it's been like this from here till the end I finished the second once again I will show you how we are going to turn uh, when making the last pattern we are turning back we will make slip stitches till this center inserting my hook in the following stitch making a slip stitch inserting my hook in the center making another slip stitch now I am in the center now I am going to make uh, three chains one two three yarn over inserting my hook in the center and I am making one chain yarn over inserting my hook in the same space and making two more double crochet in the same space one and two making five chains one two three four five yarn over and going to the center of the following pattern making a double crochet yarn over inserting my hook in the same space making the second double crochet making one chain and in the same space making two more double crochet this is one and this is two and making five chains one two three four five and after making yarn over going to the center of the following pattern and doing the same thing as I told you we will finish the same uh, pattern till we finish the cardigan pattern is like this dear friends it is really so easy we are going to make this till our uh, armpit the length of this back pattern will be till our uh, armpit if you have already a cardigan dear friends you can uh, use the same measurements you can uh, crocheting by measuring it uh, to your uh, cardigans that you are still wearing or uh, you can be careful about the points that I informed you first of all we are making chains from one shoulder point the other shoulder the length of the chains will be like this minus 48 centimeters yours can be different uh, yours of course will be according to the size of your uh, own size and then we are making this pattern row by row we will do it till we come to our uh, armpit of course uh, our cardigan uh, will not be very stretched it will be a bit uh, loose uh, a bit large for this reason it will be a bit uh, below your ar armpit not uh, just in the size of your armpit it can be a bit uh, loose here because we want a uh, loose we want a large uh, cardigan in order to wear especially in the beaches or in summer times okay we are going on row by row making the same pattern till we come to the size uh, till your armpit when you crochet uh, i will show you what we are going to do the next i finished till my uh, armpit i made 23 centimeters dear friends it's been like this I measured it from here till here like this minus 23 centimeters dear friends of course this is uh, my size your size can be different less or more uh, first of all uh, we are finishing this uh, back part till our armpit from now on for the second step we are going to crochet the front parts as the second step we are going to crochet the front parts dear friends from here till our breast from here till our breast this side like this we are going to make this part one part and the other part we are going to crochet these two parts dear friends till our uh, breast we already crocheted at the back side till our armpit uh, a bit uh, below the armpit 
two centimeters. You are putting your hands uh, under your armpit and two fingers and this measurement uh, it should be a bit uh, more than your armpit and then making one chain and cutting the yarn we started the back side from here with these chains we will make uh, the two parts for the front part till our breast from here and also from here this line is uh, the top side of our back for this reason the front parts will be like here and also here I am taking two stitch marker in my hand I'm counting this pattern one two three four this four pattern will be a uh, one part of our front side till our breast I am putting a stitch marker here I am going to the other side one two three four I am counting and in the fourth pattern I am putting a stitch marker we are going to crochet this side firstly and then the other side secondly we will uh, go on crocheting from the front side dear friends this is the back side this is the front side I will start from here taking my hook in my hand making a movable knot firstly inserting my hook in this place but this is only one uh, play yarn so in order to make it uh, strongly I am inserting my hook in this place this is one double crochet this is second double crochet one chain making two more double crochet in the same space this is one and this is two five chains one two three four five yarn over going to the center of the other part I'm not inserting my hook here because uh, this will be uh, large this this space will be large and it will not look good later on so it is better to insert here one chain two double crochet it's been like this five chains one two three four five yarn over going to the center of the following making two double crochet firstly and then one chain two double crochet more five chains one two three four five yarn over going to the fourth pattern taking the stitch marker off one chain inserting my hook in here like this it's been like this dear friends now I am turning back and I will come to the center by slip stitches making one slip stitch in the following place making another slip stitch in the center three chains one two three yarn over one chain inserting my hook in the same space 
making two more double crochet it's been like this making five chains one two three four five yarn over coming to this center the center of the following pattern I mean making two double crochet first and then making one chain making two more double crochet in the same space yes we are making the same pattern what we did for the back side dear friends we are coming to the end of uh, this row I came to the end of this row we are turning to the other side we are coming to the center by slip stitches and making the same pattern dear friends making one two three chains yarn over inserting my hook making a double crochet and doing the same pattern how long we are going to make this uh, front pattern uh, it shouldn't be long as the back part it should be uh, on top of our breast dear friends or if you want it uh, more close you can make it uh, shorter if you want it uh, more open uh, you can make it uh, a bit longer but uh, my project is till out here here we are going to crochet one part till here another part till here this is starting uh, point of our breast we are we are going to make like this till here after that we are i'm going to show you what we are going to do for the other for the rest but for now uh, let's crochet till the top of our breast still here okay dear friends let's finish the first uh, part first uh, yes dear friends I crocheted this now I will tell you how many rows I made 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 16 rows I made dear friends uh, I tried it on me it is okay for my size and I will also tell you how many centimeters it is 19 centimeters dear friends uh, from now on I'm going to make a few rows uh, larger than this side this is the shoulder side we came to the starting of our breast and from breast uh, it will be a bit longer like this for this reason I will uh, crochet till here firstly I came to the end of this row now I will make larger this side for this reason I need chains you know when we start uh, the first row uh, we are skipping seven chains in order to make the pattern for this reason for each chain space I am making seven chains one two three four five six seven and then making chain eight in this chain eight we are going to make this pattern uh, I'm going to make one more from this pattern for this reason making seven chains more one two three four five six seven and making one more chains this uh, chain is for the pattern I mean for this pattern and then I am going to make seven chains more because I will make uh, three from this like this pattern I will make one two three I make chains for the two of them I need one more for this reason I'm making seven chains more one two three four five six seven and one more ch uh, chain for the lace pattern I'm in this one and for double crochet I am making three chains one two three turning back yarn yarn over I am going three chains back and in the fourth I am inserting my hook yarn over pull through I am making a double crochet here with this three chains it is two double crochet in this stitch like this 
I am making one chain, inserting my hook in the same space, making two more double crochet. This is one and this is two. The first pattern is okay. Now I am making five chain. One, two, three, four, five. And I am counting seven chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Skipping the seven, uh, inserting my hook in the eight one. And I am going to make the pattern. First of all, making two double crochet, one chain, two double crochet more. I'm making five chains, one, two, three, four, five, seven chains. I'm counting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Skipping this, going to the eighth one, inserting my hook in there. And first of all, uh, making two double crochet. This is one. This is two. And then one chain, inserting my hook in the same space, making two more double crochet for the pattern. This is one. And this is two. It's been like this. There is seven chains also here. I'm making five chains. One, two, three, four, five, yarn over. Now going to this uh, pattern. From now on, we are crocheting. From now on, we are crocheting uh, what, what we did uh, for the previous rows. We are coming here in the same way, dear friends. I came to the end of this row like this. Now I will turn and I will go on crocheting till the end of uh, this row, dear friends. I came to the end of this row as well. Let me show it to you, dear friends. It's been like this. Like this we made. This side, this side totally will be in the same length with the back side. For this reason, I am folding it. This is the place. I am folding from the place we started for the front. Like, like this. It will be in the same length. You can count rows if you like. For example, I counted the back side. This is 23 rows. I also counted the front side from the starting till the end, till the end, including these two rows. It is 19 rows, dear friends. That means I have to uh, go on crocheting till I come to the total row 23 uh, for the front part because this front part totally and the back part will be in the same length when I fold it. Okay, dear friends. I have to make the front part also 23 and then I will show you what we are going to do the next. I finished this side. I counted. It is totally 23 from here till the end. It is totally including this rows from here till the end of the row it is 23 rows this is the same row with the back part here now uh, the front part and the back part is in the same length I made this side with three pattern 
you can make it two or three according to the uh, breast size uh, of your own size uh, three is okay for me now what we are going to do dear friends we are going to make the same pattern here the same whatever we did this side we are going to make the same at the other side Since I am finished uh, this side I am making one chain and cutting the yarn now I will start at the other side I am going to make exactly what I did for the other side for this part exactly the same I am doing here I will start here I will come here I will do the same here and then I will enlarge the pattern exactly the same I did here and uh, the back and front side till our uh, armpit uh, will be finished and then I will show you how we are going to uh, connect all the parts and how we are going to uh, go on till we finished I came to the end of uh, this side dear friends I made one two three four five uh, six rows when I count from here till the top it is 23 rows I made the back side also 23 rows the front side of rows equal to the back side rows now we are going to connect the armpit side we will leave this uh, space for arm we will connect these two parts uh, in the uh, armpit level here for this reason I am coming uh, to the end of uh, this side and when I come to the end of this side this row will be uh, one two three four five six seven this row will be seven when I come to the when I come to this side dear friends and I will show you how we are going to connect this side with the other and how we are uh, going to get the uh, arm uh, space I came to the end of this side here now I am making five chains one two three four five yarn over I am taking the side of the back side inserting my hook in this yarn over making the pattern in the center five chains now from now on we are applying the same pattern till the end one chain two more double crochet yes we connected uh, the front part and the back part now I will go on till the end of this side dear friends when I come here I will show you once again how we are going to uh, connect the front part and also the back part and leave the uh, arm space for for the other arm okay first of all let's uh, go to the end of this side I came to the end of this side I am making five chains one two three four five and uh, I'm taking the end of the front side and like this I will go on crochet uh, in the same way this is the front side I am also uh, going on in the same way yarn over inserting my hook in the center making the same pattern okay I've uh, connected back part and front part of the other side like this it's been now I am going on crocheting till the end of this side dear friends 
I came to the end of this side. I'm turning back, coming to the center. making the same pattern and always doing the same thing till the end of the other side. Once again, I will show you when we come to the uh, arm place. I came to the uh, arm place. I came to the place uh, that we connected these two parts. I'm just doing standard pattern. Five chains, one, two, three, four, five. Skipping this chain, going to the other part and going on crocheting the same pattern. I will go on crocheting till the end of the row when we come to this place we are going to make the same thing and we will come to the end from now on all the rows will repeat to each other uh, till we come to the enough size for our uh, vest the length of the vest depends on you you can make it longer or you can make it uh, shorter uh, that's co complete it depends how you like it I will make this long for this reason in both sides I will make skirt slash and I will show you how we are going to make it from now on let's uh, go on repeating the pattern when we come to the enough uh, size of waist uh, that we want dear friends okay let's go on crocheting again and again in the same pattern it's been like this and here we are going to make the skirt split. From now on, I will crochet uh, here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, this place separately. When I finish this uh, in the length I need. And then I will go on the back side separately. I mean from here till the other place. I will crochet and then uh, when I finish the back side separately, I will go on crocheting this time the other uh, front side from here one two three four five six and seven uh, in the length that I want. It's been like this for now. I will go on uh, more and more. It's not in the length I need. This is the front side, one part of front side. This is the other uh, front side, other part of front side. Yes, dear friends, we came to the end of the first part. In the second part, I'm going to explain you how we are going to finish this beautiful cardigan. Thank you so much for watching this video till now. Please remember to subscribe my YouTube channel, activate the info bell. Please leave like remarks and make comments and share my videos for my future video tutorials. Thank you so much, dear friends. See you in the coming videos.